So in a plasma propulsion, uh, plasma is a gas where it's, uh, it's, it's a charged gas. So in other words, the atoms that are normally complete with their protons in the nucleus and the, the appropriate number of electrons to match, those electrons are negatively charged, protons are positively charged, atoms are neutral. Yeah, if you, if, you, if you kick off the electrons, now the atom is no longer neutral and the whole gas will respond to magnetic fields. I mean, it's a fascinating phenomenon. The sun is a big ball plasma and that's why it's got these weird, it's got sunspots. It's not yeah. just a gas sitting there minding its own business. There's right. phenomenon occurring in it. So a plasma rocket is, a, is, a, is set up so that it kicks out particles charge particles out the back. And so what does your spacecraft do in response? It moves it, forward. It goes right. forward, it recoils, correct. So the, when you are a plasma, you can react to magnetic fields, electric fields, you can do things with it and do very fascinating things. Like you can become a star with, with a turbulent surface such as is our sun. So uh, with a plasma rocket, one of the charged particles is channeled so that it gets kicked out the back. And one of Newton's laws of motion is for every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. Action was his word for force. So right. and in this case, you kick something out the back that there's momentum going out that way. You recoil in the other direction. Your acceleration is slow. Yeah. Okay. However, you could do this if it's a long journey, you just keep accelerating. Okay. And once you get an acceleration that you like, maybe 1G, then on the ship, your journey is at 1G.